Well, this is Lytham St. Anne's uh, Coastal Resorts, and uh, as you can see, I'm just parked off the side of the road. And uh, this is a boating lake where a lot of people come and play on the boats and have a nice day and have a nice time. And it's a lovely walk around this place, and you can walk all the way around. Um, obviously, uh, it's a bit chilly, Bob's today. So this is the other side of the boating lake and uh, as you can see just down there there's little Walter sat there in his all his little glory. Now if I cross the road <laughs> dog having a good time. I think the tide's coming. I love watching the tide come in. I don't know what it is about watching. Here we go. Happy dog look. Here he goes. <laughs> what a happy soul. Like I said, I don't know what it is about watching the tide come in. It just marvels me every time. And it's so peaceful and it's so relaxing just watching it. Just watching it creep in. Now on the opposite side of the bay, that over there, that's Southport. And uh, it comes round and then you're heading into Preston. And then the other side of me, uh, that way is Blackpool. It's a lovely little spot, it's nice and quiet, no hassle. Where I'm parked is a bit questionable, I don't think I'll be stopping here tonight. I don't like being on uh, on the side of the road. I like a bit of uh, I like a bit of um, distance between me and the traffic. And where I am is slap bang right next to the traffic. But this is uh, this is lovely here. Oh yeah, it's rushing in now. I better not stop here too long. I'll get cut off. <laughs> Fat stupid man stuck in stuck in sand. Well, it's such a difference sat here today uh, that it has been over the last few days. Um, it's been very very windy, and uh, well, Walter has been blowing like this during the day and during the night. But sat here, um, it's it's just a very slight breeze, and it's so calm. No, nice and quiet and there's no hustle and bustle and you know things like this i'll just show you what i'm looking at look at that how how calm and peaceful is that and it's times like this i need to think about when i was working with all the stress and the strain that i was putting myself through then and i didn't like it and uh doing this has has made me a lot happier a lot calmer a lot less stress and i can deal with a lot more problems than I could do before without getting all irate and angry and things like that because depression is a, a, it's a difficult thing I've got a really good sniff round look <laughs> happy jugal see you later it's um, it cost me my marriage and it cost me a couple of jobs as well uh, you know because I was a dick at work and I'm, I'm not too big of a man not to accept that and you know it's uh, it's good to sit here and just watch the world go by. There's lots of people just walking past and you know enjoying the day. And another thing is when you do this sort of thing, when you go off into the wild blue yonder of uh, van life, and you, you find out who your real friends are. And uh, you know I keep banging on about my mate Smith, and he he is a true friend. He's he's helped me out on many occasions and my dad I won't be able to do this without uh, having the support of my dad and you know hearing him say you know he, he's proud of me that, that that makes me all warm and fuzzy inside but it does uh, it does tend to make you reflect on on the past I don't like doing that because you can't change the past but this is why I'm doing this so I can change the future but anyway uh, it has been very cold and I've, I have been struggling in Walter 
uh, with the cold because it has been a bit of a, a baptism of fire going from 40 degrees down to like this morning it was six degrees in the van and uh, with the weather that it's been like with uh, the, the the cloud cover even though i've got the extra panel i've just got enough to uh, you know last me and have the heater on at night and that's about it so i've got to be a little bit conservative with the power but it's all a learning curve this is the first year you know i'm only coming up to my first six months of doing this and uh, it's it is a big learning curve but it's a good one so uh, you know once i got this winter out of the way and I, I know how to handle this one winter you know the tricks and things like that uh, i'll be fine but this is a, a really nice calming spot it's brilliant if i had a bag of chips i'd just literally tip it off well this is just a, a little wander around the beach front at litham you know, if you're around here, come and have a, have a walk about here. Obviously, it's a bit chilly bobs now with the weather. But uh, it's well worth coming to have a look. And you can walk for miles down here. Literally miles, all down the front. And if you wanted to, you can have a walk all the way up to Blackpool, where you can, is a brilliant cycle path, which will take you all the way up to the front of Blackpool, so you can enjoy the lights and and uh, the Kiss Me Quick hats and Thousand Lick Lollies. So anyway, just a little video of what's been going on around here and how cold it is. <laughs> thank you very much for watching. Um, thank you again for all your support. Uh, come along for the ride and have a great day. Stay later, bye.